Hello. Over the next few minutes, you'll learn how to introduce a marker signal to a dog that will become the foundation to help develop future behaviours. Before I hand over to Gemma at Loughborough, a quick reminder to fill in the paper how-to guide for this training and file it away either on your dog's clipboard or in their file, whether that's stored on paper or online, depending on your rehoming centre. Now it's time to hand over to Gemma at Loughborough with Rue. I'm writing the dog's name on the how-to guide to make sure there is consistency across all the training that we do with Rue. And today we're using some treats as a reward and a clicker to mark. You can use markers such as clickers or words to let your dog know that they have done something right. It is a way of pinpointing the exact behaviour that you want from them. The marker is instantly followed by a reward. If using a clicker, assess the dog's reaction to the sound to check that they do not appear to have any negative associations or responses. Look for signs which indicate the dog is uncomfortable when they hear the click. If this occurs, discuss with your centre training and behaviour team. Cue the dog with a behaviour they already know, for example, a sit. sit. Now your marker has meaning, we can use it in busier environments and to teach new behaviours. So that's it. You have hopefully by now successfully introduced your dog to a marker and a world of new behaviours are potentially only clicks away. By teaching dogs new behaviours, they are more likely to find homes and hopefully happy ones too.